Hey friends, it is Tracy and I am doing my part one long-term sinking funds that will include my puppy binder, my new car binder, and my Christmas binder. <laughs> I do split these long-term savings into two separate videos just because there's so many categories and I like to save you guys so much time um, and also save myself some time. <laughs> All right, we're going to jump into Christmas first. So let's get out our money. I use these envelopes, cash envelopes that I got from Sav Saves. She only launches these randomly, and then <laughs> you have to, like, grab one right away, and then they're gone. So uh, if you know somebody else that makes them or if you want to make them for yourself, that's up to you. But this is what I use, and I save money throughout the month to be able to stuff so we get four paychecks a month and then I squirrel away a little bit of money each month out of there. I only have two 20s because I wasn't able to condense this down. So let's just kind of see how it works out. <laughs> I, yeah. <laughs> so this is my Christmas binder. Um, I am saving for various things such as gifts, uh, a new Christmas tree. We do need a new artificial tree. I'm an artificial girl. Uh, dinner so normally we host like last Christmas we hosted dinner and it cost about $500 this year for that side of the family we are traveling so I do need to change this label because now I need to take that $500 and put it towards gas in a hotel <laughs> so I'm still gonna spend the same amount of money it's just it's going to a different category so I need to remember to remind myself to update that. Uh, decorations, so this is be any extra money that we had if we wanted to buy any like holiday decor, and then that's it. So those are my categories. These are my savings challenges. Once these savings challenges are finished, that money will funnel into one of those five categories that I just showed you. So my little Snoopy guy here, because I can't think of Christmas and not think of like Snoopy. <laughs> <laughs> and like Charlie Brown Christmas. So that's why I picked this paper clip. I just think it's so cute. But this is letting me know where I left off from last time. And we did this cute little Christmas tree sticker challenge. This is from Liz over at Liz and Less. So I'm gonna try to get some change back. Five, six, seven, eight dollars is what is in here. If I do, let's see. <laughs> Because I have a 20, I could do a 12. Um, she doesn't have anything for 12. I could do, well, I could do seven. Well, I could do two sixes, and that'll give me 12. Or I can do a seven and a five, and that would give me 12 as well. Let's do a seven and a five. Because the two sixes look too similar. No, there's a six here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, just move on, Tracy. This is way too complicated. So this is my Norwegian um, Christmas tree. I'm trying to think of what I named it. It was either Sven or Olga. <laughs> well, that must have been Sven. I think this is Olga. Because <laughs> it's so cute. Um, let's do this little guy. Six dollars. We're gonna do two sixes now, I guess. And he looks, I mean, you got Sven. We're gonna say that this one is Otto. And I'm gonna do that for my grandpa. His, um, he has two middle names. One of his middle names is Otto. It's a German thing. Um, yeah, it looks kind of like him. <laughs> so we're gonna have Otto and Let's do this cute little tree here. And we are gonna call her Emma. Otto and Emma. Emma is the middle name of um, my grandma that just passed away. So we're kind of paying some homage to them. So if I put in a 20 and I needed to pay 12, I should get eight back. Five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> See what I'm doing here? This is probably more trees than I normally would have done. But when you only have two $20 bills, you have to make it work. So now we have three beautiful little Christmas trees. They're all Scandinavian, uh, European. 
I don't know why my brain just goes there. Okay. And I just, oh, I love this one. I own two of these Christmas tree challenges from Liz because it is probably one of my favorites outside the beaver one, which is my top one. Okay, next up is Merry and Bright. So this one is from Sisters on a Budget. And this one I get to color in. So let's do five, six. Now I'm not gonna do 12. <laughs> Let's come back to this one because I feel like if I have a one, I could easily do that. We're gonna come back to that one. I know, this is a lot more complicated when I don't have money. <laughs> okay, let's do a scratch one because this one I can't control as much. So we already saved seven. This is from um, Living Simple Studios. I just think it's so cute. And if I get the Rudolph, I have to double it. So we're gonna hope we don't get the Rudolph. I'm pretty sure this one's Rudolph, Dasher, Dancer, Prancer, Vixen, Comet, Cupid, Donner, and Blitzen, and Rudolph. If they go in order, this is Santa, I think. Let's be this one. Oh, 13, oh, but if I go 13, and that one was seven, that's 20. So although I didn't plan to do that, because I didn't wanna give that much money, I owe, I put in 20, I take seven back, and now we have all the money <laughs> that we need to do the other ones. Oh my goodness. And I know $40 doesn't seem like a lot, and I wish that I could save. All right, sorry, I forgot to clean off my scratch residue before I stuck it in there. So now, then it was throwing everything on there. Um, what I was trying to say is that I wish I could save more, but I just have to work with what my budget will allow right now. Uh, we've been doing some traveling, and so money's just been allocated more towards travel and less towards Christmas at this moment. Let's just do, um, let's do $2, and we'll do two more colors onto here. All right, so we added two more dollars. I colored in the R and the I, which were each were worth a dollar. And yes, <laughs> so, so far we have saved five, six, seven, eight. Nothing real huge. This is a $65 challenge. So we're not too worried about it. Okay, next up is my Grinch. This one is a $100 challenge. There's not a lot of bulbs, and honestly, I might have an IOU. <laughs> um, I got a 10 last time. 12, oh my gosh. Okay, it's pretty much taking most of my money. <laughs> All right, so five, 10, 11, 12. We have a whole $1 left. Wow. <laughs> this is from Jesse Budgets. I think it's so cute. 5, 10, 15, 20, 1, 2. So we've saved $22 out of the 100. These hearts, they're growing big. My heart's growing big just doing this. <laughs> Not in the good way. Okay, next would be, this is champagnes. I love this challenge. I know it's not gonna be a dollar, so we're gonna mark this as the one that I start with next time because it's a $75 challenge. She does like spicy and nice. <laughs> It'll be like a $2 and then a $15 and an $8 and then a $23. And because I only have $1, I just don't have it in me. Uh, this one is smaller. We have one that would be one dollar. No. <laughs> we have that roll and save, which is potential. Okay, we're just gonna go back here and we're gonna color in one more on here. This is really just gonna be a catch-all for me. So I'm gonna add one more dollar and I'm gonna color in another letter. All right, <laughs> so we colored it in. Thank you, Sisters on a Budget, for having a low-income challenge for me just to help me out when I just don't have a lot. Um, I'm hoping as the year progresses, I will be able to save a little bit more, but right now, I just I only had $40.
and it's $40 more than I have. But sometimes when you're saving, it just doesn't feel like you're putting a whole lot towards something, but it's all gonna add up. So I'm okay with that. All right, Christmas is done. Next up is new car. All right, so this is my new car binder. In here, I just have my little fun little dashboard. Okay, where do we leave off? We already did Shroom Shroom. We did these ones. Okay, we already have an IOU. Awesome. <laughs> How much money do we have for new car this month? We have 20, 35, 40, 2, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50. 50 dollars. So again, I don't have a lot of money to allocate but a little bit saved is better than nothing. So let's do my $2 into here. We're gonna pay my IOU. And we now are paid up and good to go. So we had five, 10, 15, 20, two, three, four, five, 25 dollars. And hopefully we'll get back to this one, but with fifty dollars, I just don't know. <laughs> okay, next was my Larry challenge. This is from Elisha over at Hands and Bands, and it comes in this cute little box. And she has her Larry cards. Oh, yes, um, it does come with a little scratcher. I did put that in there just to remind me that it's a card set game that I'm playing. But I'm just gonna stick with my corn for now, just so I don't have to dig that out and you know <laughs> so we're gonna grab a larry card and scratch and see how much we owe Ooh. oh boy 21 okay larry you are angry <laughs> are you hangry do you need lunch <laughs> ochi mama but we did it we got it done 21 dollars so we're gonna do the 20 and the one so we just started this one now. It's our first time doing it. I know she had different levels when she made these. I don't know if mine's the high income one or the low. Either way, I, like, I wanna save her a car, but I was not prepared for that 21, <laughs> to be honest. Okay, so that one's done. Let's put it at the bottom so that we know it's finished. And then next time we'll just grab another card off the top. Next is Save What? This is from Champions Corner. This makes me smile every time I see it. I just, there's something about those faces, the saying, everything. I love this challenge. And I wanted to do a D10 where I roll between a 10 and a 90 dice. And I know that's a spicy amount. I'm not gonna be able to do that today. So I'm gonna roll a D20. So this has numbers one through 20, and we're just gonna see what we get. We got lucky number 13. So we're gonna put 13 on here. One and three, you guys can't see that, awesome. <laughs> I'm gonna use my little magic eraser, which these things work amazing for laminated items. Let me tell you, 13, okay. So let's say 13, 10, 12, and 13 dollars. So we officially started save what? <laughs> I just love it. Oh, it's just so cute. <laughs> this one I feel like is me. I have big blue eyes, so it that one feels like it's me. And I love ducks. Um, this next one is Pimp Your Ride. This is from Sisters on a Budget, but each of these cars is $100. That is not in my budget today. So we're gonna go back to the front. <laughs> um, now we have Liz's Shroom Shroom, which is so cute. This is Skip. <laughs> oh man. Um, let's do, we're cheap today. We're gonna do $4. So I'm gonna put in a five and take out a one. 
And this is a $50 challenge, so this is like right up my alley for my budget this month. Let's see, so we have Skip, and now I want a Todd. Todd the Toad. <laughs> and Skip was the bicycle. Todd, Todd looks like kind of this little wrinkly guy, right? <laughs> I'm getting Todd vibes. If you have a Todd in your life, does this look like him? I don't know. So here's Todd. <laughs> Skip and Todd. Yes. It's funny because like Todd looks like a wrinkly, older, more mature um, natured mushroom. And Skip is a little young one. <laughs> it's just so cute. I don't know. Oh. It's adorable. All right, so we saved seven dollars so far. Next up is my new car fund. This is a sticker one where I put the stickers on to my grid here, and it is ten dollars per sticker. Five, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, that worked out really, really well. So we are going to put one little car on here, one beep beep, beep beep, beep beep, and there we go. Once this is done, there's 52 cars, so you could use this as a 52 week um, kind of challenge. I am just going to do it as I can, so $10 is going in, and we have $20 so far then, because I've only done two cars. And then next time, I'm gonna take my bubblegum paperclip, which is from Budget with Carly. This thing is so cute. And we are gonna do Harriet next month. Oh, I love this. It's Harriet Goes to Town. It's from Saving with Peggy. I love taking Harriet through the town to collect, like do her little chores. And then this one like looks like her um, grandma, like who she made the savings challenge off of. So I love that I have the scratch off to go with it too. And then we'll be back to her. <laughs> Rolling the rainbow, which was not so nice to me last time. Okay, new car is done. Last up is our puppy binder. Oh, this one brings me so much joy. Let's grab our money from our envelope and see how much we have today. I have 20, 40, 50, 65, 72, 3, 4, 5. So we have $75 to work with which is the most out of any category today. Why? Because I want a puppy. <laughs> but first, I have to do my puppy binder. This is from Janelle over at Janelle Ray Budgets. I love it. I was gifted this to me from Tracy McCarty, and she made sure to put my favorite little puppy on there, and then the Golden Girl Budget. It's so cute. So last time we did weeks one through four, this time, oh, can I do five through eight? Let's see, five plus six plus seven plus eight, twenty-six dollars. Well, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. Twenty-five and six. Oh, my elbow is hurting today. <laughs> I feel like Lizzie where she's just having like arm pain and I think I'm having sympathy pains for her. <laughs> All right, so we did five, six, seven, and eight. I think that's how I checked them before. Yep. Awesome. So then next time we will do nine, 10, 11, and 12. Yikes. How much is that gonna be out of curiosity? Ooh, 42, um, we're gonna do the best that we can. <laughs> okay, that one is done. Now to my puppy binder. So in the front, I have the various categories that I'm saving up for for a puppy. Obviously, we need money to buy one. Um, we need vet money, we need food money, toys and boarding so if we travel we're gonna have to board our dogs and then miscellaneous so these are all the things I'm saving for I do have $1,800 so far 
1500 $1,800 in the adoption part of it. I think that would be enough to get a puppy. That's why I kind of stopped it at that. In the vet, I currently have 50 65 However, um, when I deposited that $420 that I got from all the G-Bucks in 2023, I did not put that money in here yet. So, so far we had $1,800 plus $50.65, and now I need to add the $420, and that gets me to $2,285 so far saved, plus the money that's like behind here working towards other challenges. So let me grab the 420. We are gonna add that to the vet one because we do wanna have a healthy amount in the... And just the minor correction, it was $425 because each of those bundles were in $25 bundles by saving G bucks. So in our vet fund now, we have almost $500. 100, 200, 300, 400. 50, 70, 85, 90. So $490. And for those that are wondering, I do use prop money in this category and my new category, or new car category, because I automatically transfer this money to my high yield savings account, which I am trying to earn interest on. I don't need to keep cash in here because I can put it in my account and earn interest. If anyone is interested in a high yield savings account, I do have a link below in my description. They gave me like a limited time offer. There's no pressure. You don't have to go with Ally. Um, that's who I use. It's just there if you were interested or wanted to look it out, um, look into it. There's, I think, a special offer in there, but you'd have to agree to the terms and it has to make sense for you. So we have 1800 in adoption, not 490 in vet, and then we have food, toys, etc. left but I want to get at least $2,000 into the vet one because we all know if you're a pet owner how much of vets can add up. And the puppy stage and the geriatric stage are usually the worst when it comes to the amount of money that you use. Okay, so first up is my steampunk dogs. This is from Carmen over at the Humble Budgeter. It comes with a set of I don't even remember how many cards, like 20, could be less or more, I don't remember, but they're all these different faces. I've only put two of them in here for now because it'd be a little bit too much to stuff all of those little doggy heads in there, <laughs> but these just make me smile every time. Um, each card has uh, numbers one through 12, and then once all the cards are done, you'll save $1,224. So this really is a great challenge for saving up for um, my vet fees. So we got a two dollar. We like the two. Should we do a second one? Let's do a second one because two is not that bad. Nine. Okay, we're gonna give eleven dollars today. Uh, Ten and eleven. So nine plus two is eleven. And so far for this first card, we saved 10, 15, 17, 18 dollars. And again, I just only put a couple cards in to start. I love that it comes with a dashboard. She has so many different designs. Um, I obviously picked the dogs one, but she has even new dog ones and I want them so bad, but I have to finish the ones I have first. <laughs> okay, next up is whoever says you can't buy happiness, forgot about Frenchies. Oh my gosh, this was made for me from Janelle Ray Budgets. And it is so cute. This is me and I have an eye patch because she knows I had an eye patch as a kid. And you just work along and you save the money and then you'll, at the end you'll see how much you saved. So this is where we left off. We bought some food. <laughs> I do have to roll a dice. I'm gonna use these cute little bone dice that I got from Lizzie over at Busy Lizzie's Budget. And let's just see how far we're willing to go. <laughs> Ooh, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. But I can't remember. Stop at each. 
So I have to stop at the obstacle and I also have to pay this. So each obstacle is five and then I owe the two. So I owe $7 today. So we're gonna pay five, six, seven. And we're just gonna do that for today. So far we have 5, 10, 12, 14, 15 dollars. Let me take out these, let me condense this down. So I'm going to do a 10 and a 5, so we have 15, and I'm taking out the 10. So that goes back. So 15 dollars is still what we have in here. I just think it's so cute. <laughs> We're gonna get the little Kong toy. Oh, it's <laughs> so adorable. Okay. I'm gonna do this one and then I'm jump into this book that I have in the back. So first we will do this scratch off. This is from Rami over at Budget Paparazzi. It is a $150 challenge, but there's a lot of little numbers in here. However, there's 120. So let's just not get the 20 today. <laughs> That's all I care about. $5. We can handle $5. All right, so we're gonna put $5 in. So in total, we have $10 in here. And she's being nice to me. Rami loves me. <laughs> and she's giving me small, small amounts. And I appreciate it. Okay, so next up would be the doggy in the window. But... I want to get some knocked off on this book that I got from Kimberly Budgets. So let's mark this here for now and we can always come back. Because I only have 75, I have to work with what I got. Okay, so I got this book gifted to me from Tracy McCarty. Again, she spoiled me and it is from Kimberly Budgets. It's a monthly challenge. I'm not gonna use this as a monthly. I'm just gonna kind of go with it. Uh, it's super, super cute, and I love that she included um, an envelope in there, so that's where I store the money. That's why it's not its own separate envelope in my binder. So let's do, ooh, we got another five. Okay, so we owe five, and I try to do one on the back here. So let's do, and as you can see, I was like, I got so lucky last month because I landed perfectly on the number that I needed. Ooh, three. Okay, so we're at eight. Might stop there for now. And then I can finish up here if I need to. So let's do eight dollars. do a 20 I would get 12 back and I don't have enough for that so let me change out my 20 real quick and I'll be right back so that 20 I traded it out for 10 15 17 18 19 20 because this will just be easier for me this is one of the perks of having prop money is that I don't have to have exact change on me at all times all right we're adding eight so let's do a 10 and we'll take out two. Okay, so in here we have 10, 15, 16, 17, 18 dollars saved. So cute. And we will come back to this if we can get through the rest of these. I just want to make sure I hit this because there's so many pages in here that I want to touch it every single month. Okay, grab my little teacup guy. <laughs> Next up is from the Thrifty Sewist, and this is the doggy in the window, the pet shop. I think this is so cute. What I do is I do a tag and I buy something. I am going to roll a dice. We're going to do a 12-sided dice. And it rolled off, but we got $2. So we're going to mark we bought something for $2. What should we buy for $2? Maybe a ball. A ball would be about $2. Especially if you get the cheap ones at PetSmart. 
<laughs> All right, so we bought a ball for $2. Let's put my two in. So, so far we've saved five, seven, eight dollars. I just think this is so cute. <laughs> Okay, next is from my Wren over at Mischief Managed Budgets. I mean, who doesn't love a dog in a sweater? Oh, I just, I could gobble. I could just gobble him up. Okay, let's see what we get next. It's a $60 challenge. Ooh, four, okay. <laughs> For a hot minute, I thought it was a 40 and I was about to lose my mind. <laughs> Thankfully, Wren loves me and she would not do that to me. <laughs> All right, 10 and four, so we have $14 saved out of $60. So next is a Frenchie in Paris. This is from Teach, Save, Travel. Um, a Frenchie, yes, this looks just like my Ollie Bear. Um, there is a black Frenchie that I see every single day being walked and it's so cute. I want to go up to it and just like snuggle its face. <laughs> but I'm not awkward and weird, so I won't. Um, let's do five. Let's just do one today because we're going to save the rest for the next one. So we're going to put a five in there today. So now we have $15 saved. There's the 10. We're going to add the five. And I don't need to pull out that other 10 for that reason. We're at $15. I love it. It's nice little easy numbers. Okay, next is from Budget Better Life. And as you can see, we've saved the five so far. How much money do we have? Two, three, four, five, six, seven dollars. Do we gamble it and scratch? Or do we pick a six? Well, we scratched last time, so maybe we just pick the six today and not gamble so much. All right, so we're gonna do the six. Two, three, four, five, and six. So we have one dollar left over. We're gonna add the six to the five. That gives us 11. No need to pull out that five, just so you guys can see me count it in a pile. <laughs> Oh, all right, then this last one is great because it's going to collect this $1 bill. This is from Rocks Budgets. I think this is so adorable. There's the little Boston Terrier, which is my favorite. Oh my gosh, that one and this one. So they're a little quirky. <laughs> Let's color in the one since we're putting in $1 today. That actually worked out really nicely. And we have now saved two, four, five dollars. And we officially did every challenge. Now, would I like to do more in each of them? Absolutely. But that book took up a lot of it. <laughs> so let's start with this book next time, just so it gets a little bit more love. Sound good to you guys? Sounds good to me. <laughs> all right, that's all I have for today. I will see you on Friday for my savings challenge video. Have a good one. Bye.